Water going through it. Water's there. Yeah. <laughs> water's here. Water's everywhere. <laughs> I saw that. And that closes. I hose. That's cock number. That's the very last thing that you want to close so you keep water supply for your customers as long as possible. That was a test. <laughs> Yeah, I don't like people watching me when I pay it. Fifty, sixteen, or twenty. <laughs> we'll walk you through it, buddy. <laughs> oh, yeah. you're in firing range. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to have to yeah. save yeah. you. You're yeah. right in firing range. Make sure all your valves are closed on the gate. Low hose, Tascock number three. Open Tascock number three. You know, when you open your Tascock slowly, but we're going to open them all the way. You know, this one sitting there kind of on an angle, so we got to get the slot perpendicular with the Tascock. Open the low bleed. Open test cock number three. Open my high bleed. Close shutoff valve number two. Close my high bleed. My gauge goes all the way over. Close my low bleed. Oh, so places we sir. Gauge stops. 8.8, .8, my parent reading cross tuck number one. Open my high control approximately one turn. Open my low control slowly. I got <laughs> Watch my game. So, you know, the more proficient you become, the faster you can make it drop. <laughs> and you know I'm doing a mental countdown. Four six, four four, four three, four two, four zero, three nine, three eight, three seven. Three six. Three six. Close the low control. My bypass hose up. In my gauge. And loosely the test cock number four. Open my bypass valve. Close my bypass valve. Tighten my nut on the test car. Open test cock number four. Man, I have got a leak on the gauge here. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and do this. So you've got a gauge leaking, we don't want to use it. Alright, we'll open my low bleed, gauge pegs, close my low bleed. 
I'm going to open my bypass. When I open my bypass is when I'm doing the test to test this against bike pressure. I'm taking this water, put it through here, through the hose, put bike pressure right here. I'm going to open my bypass valve. Okay, it's remaining steady. I'm ready to test the number two check flow tight against bike pressure. Now I'm ready to test check number one. Open my low bleed. Close my low bleed. 8.8. And that's it. I like to close my test cocks. You can close them in any order you want to. After you complete the test, how you do the rest of it is up to you. I like to close the test cocks and then open my bleed valve. What this is letting me know, if I left one of those partially open or not. You leave one partially open, you start dis disconnecting the hoses, you're going to flood somebody's home or business. Maybe lose an O-ring. Huh? Maybe lose an O-ring. I'm fixing to see what's leaking here on this. I hope what I'm seeing is not what it is.